Hi kids, hope you are all doing fine. Today I am going to tell you a story of stone soup. Once upon a time there was a heavy rain in a village. Heavy rain affected a lot. There was no electricity at all and shops were all closed. People started hiding the food, whatever they had in their homes. Even they hide food from their neighbors and friends. People were afraid of their families would go hungry if they do not store the food, what they have. Whenever anyone asked for food, their answer was always, you better keep moving on and we do not have any food. So one day a teacher who was a stranger from another village came to ask for food. He had a big pot in his hand. He knocked everyone's door and asked for food. And answers were always like this. There is not a bite to eat in the whole village. You better keep moving on. He was so tired by listening to this. He sat by one home and he made a plan of getting food. He picked a gray stone from the road and started calling people. Everyone opened their doors and came out. Most of the people were surrounded the teacher. The teacher told everyone that he have a magic stone. And he is going to make stone soup to share with all of them. Everyone was excited to have a stone soup. The teacher filled the pot with water and built a fire under that pan. Then he put a plain gray stone and added in the water. By now, everyone was looking at the teacher. Teacher was stirring the soup for a minute. And he sniffed the stone soup and licked his lips. Now they were wanted to taste too. They trusted the teacher as well. The teacher said aloud to himself, I do like this soup, but stone soup is better with cabbage. Soon a villager ran to his home and he brought a cabbage and gave it to the teacher to add to the soup. Teacher said, fantastic. And then he cut the cabbage and added in the pot. And also he said, once he had stone soup with onion and tomatoes and it was super delicious. Another villager ran to his home and brought some onions and tomatoes. And teacher again said, fantastic, and sniffed again and he licked his lips saying, oh my God, this soup is too yummy by adding onions and tomatoes. Now the villagers asked teacher, is stone soup is ready? He told them it is almost ready, but once he had a stone soup with vegetables and it was super delicious. Once again, villagers brought some vegetables like carrots, potatoes and beans. Now the teacher added every veggie to the soup and he started stirring. Big pot was bubbling and steaming. He added some spices and when the soup was ready, Everyone in the village ate a bowl of soup and it was so delicious. They all thanked teacher for this yummy soup. The villages, villagers even offered him a lot of money if he can sell that stone to them. But teacher refused to sell that stone. He just wanted to taught a lesson to work together and share everything what they have. It was a normal stone. He just taught a lesson to them. Next day, he was on his way to his village. So kids, by working together, you can have a very successful life. You can achieve anything by contributing and sharing what we can. Hope you like the story. Bye for now.